Harford is home to many pieces of art and museums. One local made it their mission to protect, perfect the art of pottery, bringing them all the way to West Texas, where their passions were able to grow into something more than just sculpting. Jason Freund, he brings you exactly that story tonight. Marfa is filled with art pieces, all pretty to look at. But Roberto Dobson is interested in a different, more practical type of art, one that he perfected after years of hard work. This work is what's called functional or tableware. It's, it's work that you actually use. You know, it's cups, bowls. If you buy a piece of this, then you, you will use it. You're not gonna just hang it on the wall or put it on the shelf. A successful dentist, Roberto and his wife sold the practice to pursue other dreams. So they moved to Alpine to attend Sol Ross University, which is where a mutual love for ceramics was discovered. The first class that my wife took at Sol Ross was ceramics. And she fell in love with ceramics. And about a year later, I asked her if I could take a class. And she said, yeah, you can take a class, but you have to stay up there at the school. Sol Ross didn't have all the classes that they needed, so they went international, honing their crafts in places like Alberta and Japan. We actually did that four times, went to Japan, because uh, we were just intrigued by the, the culture and the type of ceramics they were producing over there. Roberto and his wife traveled the world taking classes, and he eventually settled down in Marfa, where his studio is now. About eight years ago, we actually moved our studio from Alpine to Marfa, because Marfa was, is where our, our uh, sales are. That's where the market is for this work. And so uh, we're very happy to have a first class ceramic studio here in Marfa. Marfa has become a base of operations where he can sell his creations, and there are plenty of galleries to sell from in the town. And it's a town that he's going to stay in for quite some time after years of traveling the globe and perfecting his style.